Hey, we're Michael and Abby. Welcome back to another travel vlog. In this video, we're spending five days in one of the most beautiful places in the world. Jackson Hole, Wyoming. We did everything from snowmobiling to snowboarding, eating at some amazing places and saw countless moose and elk on a wildlife safari. Now join us as we take you through the stunning landscapes and thrilling adventures of Jackson Hole. As John Muir once said, in every walk with nature, one receives far more than he seeks. And here in Jackson Hole, every step unfolds a story of beauty and adventure. We have made it to Jackson Hole. Jackson Hole. Welcome to Jackson Hole. Jackson Hole. <laughs> <laughs> Jurassic Hole. That's where we're at. Had a really good flight. We got bumped to Delta Comfort. Had a little bit more leg room. It was pretty nice. But uh, Andrew, uh, Lexi, you're picking us up now. We're going to get lunch. Yeah. Yeah. And, Mo and mom and dad, Alex and Brayden are on their way too. They're, I don't know how far out they are. Hopefully we see nothing. I'm not going to jinx anything. And I still. <laughs> I spilled oh. coffee all over my sweatshirt. I tried club soda for the first time to get it out. It didn't work, it just spread it. Yeah. If you can remember to do so, be sure to hit that like and subscribe if you have not already. Ding. Ding. <laughs> yeah, and turn on notifications. That way you're reminded of every video we post. Oh, also, isn't this the coolest airport? It's so small. Like, you get off right on the tarmac, you, you walk like in land right beside the mountains. Yep, you come like... in that beautiful view of the Tetons. I mean, it was beautiful today. And uh, come right down in, and then they have the antler arch right as you walk in. Which I thought I was recording, and it oh, yeah. turned it off. with everybody and we are eating lunch first at uh, Jackson Drug Company which we did this last year. This yeah. is where the Huckleberry milkshake was. Yeah. Chicken salad. What'd you get? Cheese. And Napoleon, kind of some of your tots. Yes. Was good? It was. I got grilled cheese and tater tots. It just felt, sounded good. So we're staying at the Cowboy Village resort but we're staying in the cabin so they have a hotel and cabin so we're staying in the cabins here honestly they're very cozy i mean actually they're really nice i mean they're, they're very the bunk beds are like full-size yeah. beds yeah we just got our helmets and signed everything for the snowmobiles tomorrow and then we're gonna get some food to pack at albertson's and then uh really not sure nap. are you yeah i am abby's taking a nap we got up at what well three yeah three we set our alarms for three, I think. I think we're up at 3.30. Yeah. Oh, well, it is what it is. We made it. I'm so... I feel good. Hello. No, hey. we've just kind of been hanging out um, today. Nothing's planned. We just had lunch. We went on a little walk. Uh, watched them setting up the uh, snowmobile hill climb for this weekend. And go to dinner. And then... Hopefully turn in early because we have an early morning to leave to go snowmobiling tomorrow. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's been kind of nice. It's not been a busy day. It's been pretty chill. So yeah. this is our little cabin. There's a whole bunch of them all yeah, over the, the place. Cowboy Village Resort. Mm, yeah. There's a picnic table and it's kind of small. Oh crap. And me and and Abby and Andrew Lexi in Boston. And Boston. It so, is bed friendly. Yeah, it's just like a little kitchenette table, Boston's bed. <laughs> and then it's nice because there's bunk beds, but they're full size beds. Just yep. Oh, yeah. Luxurious and spacious. <laughs> and we've crammed all of our stuff into this tiny little corner. And this corner. And this corner. And there is a bathroom. Standard bathroom, standard procedure, toilet. All right, so that's it. It's a quick tour. Mom, Dad, Alex, and Braden's is uh, bigger, and it has wood there's floors. Did yeah, you see the bathroom? No. Yeah, so maybe we'll go do a tour of theirs. Also, I wasn't gonna wear white shoes, and Abby's like, oh, you'll be fine. So I wear white shoes, and boom, Boston.
step right away. And they don't yeah, make them anymore. Yeah, I just found out they don't make this. I have like the, the comfy cush ones and they don't make them. <laughs> hey, look. Everyone's chilling. I'm chilling on the porch. So this is the other option. Um, this one's... Bigger kitchen. Bigger yeah, this has got... <gasps> oh my gosh. I know. Is nice. I know. Gangsters. Still smells good too. Yeah. Then they got... They don't have bunk beds. So yeah. Here at Jackson Hole Mountain Village Resorts Cowboy Resort Inn. Where, where are we staying? Here at Cowboy Village Resort, you have the option. You can bunk up or get one of these. You get options here. You get options. Oh, and then they have like a hotel portion too, but these are the cabins. What? Funny baby. Jealous. <laughs> That's what Abby looks like when she's running. Very noble. <laughs> I could only wish I looked like that. Majestic. Intimidating. Everyone in the family's got pit vipers, so dad insists that I try it on his. Yeah, they're pretty cool. I don't know if I like them, but they're pretty cool. Austin's <laughs> black <laughs> <laughs> Temperature has dropped quickly, so we had to stop and get a. Uh, I had to go back to the the cabin and get uh, my coat, but Boston was. Just chilling right in the <laughs> right in the window yeah, like, in the bed. So. Yeah, it is cold, but we're gonna go to Snake River. Is that yes. where we're going? Okay, we're gonna go to Snake River for dinner right now. I don't know how much more we'll do tonight. Shower and then bed. Shower and bed. Yep. No, not a shower in bed. Yep. Shower and then bed. Oh. <laughs> Barbecue pork pizza. Never got burgers and got pizzas. Looks really good. Oh, all the pork fell off. It's bussing. Yeah, it's really good. The next morning. camera gear and he's getting a little out of sorts. What? 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 Yeah, I don't know what it is about camera gear, but it, like he absolutely loves it with a passion, but it boils his blood all at the same time. This what you say is true? <laughs> it is. It is true. The drone, you think one battery, extra battery is good just in case? Um, should I put the Polaroid in here or you think it's not? Sure. Uh, we just unloaded all the snowmobiles and we are about the snowmobile up here at Togedy Pass. Um, it's a beautiful drive up this morning. Very sunny. But yeah, okay, yeah. We This is the second time we rented from Jackson Hole Adventure Rentals. Um, yesterday they asked for my ID and I gave them my McLovin ID and they thought it was really funny. If you're looking to rent while you're here in Jackson, recommend that place. They obviously get your sleds, but also they include the gear if you need it. Um, it's a uh, yeah. It's it's a it's a good setup. I'm gonna switch to the GoPro right now, and we're riding the next two days actually. So this will be pretty fun. Here we go. Abby's unsure if she's gonna work. Okay, she's putting her helmet right now. <laughs> Are you ready?
great, do they? They're, they, uh, they look, they look like... A wet wrap? A wet wrap. I didn't think about that. Good? Yeah, Braden got Chinese. Got some Chinese out here. Gonna warm it up over the fire. Warm it up, putting some tin foil Sushi? over the fire. Oh, no, just... I've always thought about Braden. It's about to go from General So to General So Long in that fire. <laughs> that was really funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Oh my god. 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 No on the ground. Now I'm gonna eat this wrap. Yeah, it's pretty good. Get some soup up in the mountains. Just don't get any better than this. That's what our forefathers did. Only they were making stew. They had the same thermos though. I probably did. These things have been around a while. Did you bring a fork? No. The wrap's not too bad, is it? No. Um. Once you get past the uh, first couple bites of sogginess. Sogginess, yeah. That's not bad. But this is a lot better. Um, past couple years we did this. We got sandwiches. And the, the sandwiches were good. It's just yeah, a but, lot of bread. Well, the bread, but then it turns like brick hard. So it's like your jaws are tired from yeah. chewing it. But enjoying some lunch. Braden's eating his PF Chang's or Chinese food like a damn animal. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. That's worth $4. These are five. Granola bar. Braden said it's really it's like, good. Uh, peanut butter and dark chocolate. So it says right there. Dessert. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Which one do you want? It actually feels good, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. You hear the trees uh, creaking? I do. Are you cute? No, but you are. No, you are. All right. Well, lunch was good. That was a good little break. I uh, honestly, I was tired. It was very relaxing. We're gonna get ready to trails down there, and we're gonna ride for a little bit. Actually, for the rest of the day till we pack it up. We're gonna get some footage directly in front of us and see how that looks. Do you think it'll look cool? Yeah. This looks cool. Yeah. It's mounted right on the windshield. I know. Ooh, ooh. Just practicing a TikTok thing that we forgot. We posted TikTok last year. This year we did. We're gonna at least do like the. Oh, 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 oh. That's it. Now I just need a partner. And she's sitting right here. Yeah. Ready? Yep. Oh, na na na. Oh, na na na. Oh my gosh. Woo! Woo hoo! Man, we are. We're, we're America's favorite TikTok couple. Uh, like Will Ferrell on Elf? Yeah. <laughs> In the mail room. Cool. That looked really good. Gorgeous. 
Well, we just got a cowboy bar photo Alexandria took of us, so that's pretty exciting. I'm actually vlogging on the new lens today, so this is, we'll see a new camera, new lens. Um, but we're about to go to dinner at Roadhouse Brewing. We has a reservation at eight o'clock. <laughs> We got the tiny tacos this time. Jody, Jody is not serving up. I know. <laughs> you get beer can chicken, Lexi. Yep. Andrew got that as well. That was Million Dollar Cowboy Bar. Yeah, that was that was cool, but if you go in there, you need to like freshen up on your line dancing and like square yeah. dancing and yeah. No, that was that was definitely the uh, that's gotta be the hangout here. I think that was uh, very cool in there. And oh my god, there's a elk. Wow. Oh my gosh, there's an elk. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna head back and do. Uh, what did he hurt you? He bit me. What the heck? Okay, yeah, we're gonna head back. Go to bed and then start day two of snowmobiling tomorrow. But yeah, day two of snowmobiling tomorrow. Look at all that artwork. Look at all the bunnies. Bunny. 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 Tutalu Mata. The following day. And I said, what about breakfast at Persephone? Clever. <laughs> yeah, so we got a cold brew and a uh, blueberry muffin and then a maple pecan scone yeah. and a black coffee. Black coffee. And it looks super good. Is it good? Mm -hmm. That place was super nice, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, it was really cute inside. Yeah, it is. It's quaint. It's bit, oh, that's the word, quaint. That's it. But we're about to go back up to Togedy Pass and snowmobile again today. And we're heading there right now. Togedy Pass, day, day two. <laughs> Ready? days when we were settling the west I was out here trapping I spent a couple nights in this cabin of course you know like I said back then you know snowshoe was almost too deep for horseback but, you know it was another time but they were good times but it's a lot easier on a snowmobile ah. did somebody write Billy Bob Low Charlene yeah hey, bed. Like, was this a window you think probably there's a bed and um, they must have had a little fireplace oh, yeah. right in that corner. Yeah. Front door. Side door. Back window. Let's go ride. Let's go ride. <laughs>
place we ate lunch last year. Me and, me and Abby tipped over. You didn't get hurt, did you? <laughs> I did. <laughs> I need a ice cream. I, well, you're looking at it. I didn't say snow cone, I said ice cream. Well, wet, wet buffalo wraps. <laughs> These are gonna be good. Lunch. We just uh, failed at trying to TikTok. So. There's sinkholes. Yeah, well, I mean, it's so deep right here. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go hit the trails and head, work our way back towards um, the truck. <laughs> Like simple jack. What? I look like simple jack. Yeah. Hey, Lee. Well, we are done riding. Um, me, I rode Andrews and Abby rode the Polaris 850, but we had no one to uh, hold the camera for us, so we did it with our memories. If you didn't film it, it didn't happen. I know. It's a good second day of riding, um, and you're gonna see the animals tomorrow. Yeah, we're doing a wildlife tour tomorrow. Well, we are all done snowmobiling. We are all changed. We are all dolled up. And ready to fill yeah. our bellies. We're going to attempt to get... Mary, Mary Piglets. <laughs> yes, it's a Mexican restaurant. It, it has decent Yelp reviews. I I don't want to be the, the cause of a bad dinner, but... But he's going to be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, who knows. But anywho, um, yeah, we went back to the cabin, got all changed. Abby got this real cool cabin picture of me. Like, I, I really look cool. He looks like he could actually do some woodwork. Woodwork? Oh. Yeah. That look good. Two buffalo chickens and a chicken chicken. And then we got a buffalo. buffalo and then like a pineapple one. Yeah, it was a, like a marinated pineapple pork. Yeah, atmosphere, 10 out of 10. Chips and salsa, chips and queso, 10 out of 10. Tacos, to be determined. Service, literally above 10. Unbelievable. <laughs> Oh, they got the worm. Playing the blues. Dinner. Good. Amazing. Good. Wee, 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 wee. Queso was pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the service. Oh, yeah. Mona. Oh, Mona. Shout out to Mona. Yeah. yeah. The service was incredible. The, the decorations in there, masterpiece. <laughs> Yeah, the food was so good. I, I would. De that's definitely a staple in, in Jackson Leonardo Hole for us. Leonardo da Vinci couldn't even touch that. <laughs> no, not at all. Look. Early the next morning. Good morning from Jackson Hole. We are about to go on a Jackson Hole Wildlife Safari. Uh -huh. So we're going to hop in a van here with the fam. And then we are um, going to drive around and see some... See some wildlife, hopefully. Now, we by saw saying a that, lot, just us driving personally. Yeah, we saw. Honestly, we've seen a handful of moose and tons of elk, a bald eagle. So, I'm sure um, today we won't see any. I know that's <laughs> how that works. But uh, yeah, we're about to hop in the van up here.
just saw a, a, badger. a little badger. It's freaking adorable. He's so puffy and his, he has the sweetest looking face. So far we're up to what, tw 20 moose? I think 20 moose? Yeah. Something like yeah. that, yeah. Yeah, so far up to 20 moose, some elk, the, the sunrise of the Tetons, badger. It's uh, been a good, good yeah. morning. So far this is an absolute must. Do these vans have automatic transmission? Do they have four wheel drive? Gee kid, I don't know, just hit the road. Does it have automatic transmission? Does it have four wheel drive? Gee kid, I don't know, hit the road. You know where Lou Ferrigno's house is? No, I don't. I heard he's just sick of the Hollywood grind. <laughs> it's from a movie. I don't know. <laughs> Why's Ferrigno someone? Oh, he bought a place in Jackson Hole. Ah. Yeah, I think he's tired of the Hollywood grind. Right. <laughs> Yeah, we're at the Snake River lookout right now, and right here is where the famous photo by Ansel Adams was taken of the Grand Tetons in 1942. The so, Snake River? Yep. And the Grand Tetons. Although it's a little more overgrown right now, so you can't really capture that same exact shot, but um, yeah, this is pretty spectacular. But there's actually a little better view over here, I think, where the picture-wise, um, the trees like naturally frame it. Um, it looks pretty good, so we'll hop over here real fast. <laughs> Peter, our guide at Jackson Hole Wildlife Safari. Highly recommend to suggest him. Yes. He was good. He yeah. was very good. You can also follow him on Instagram at Grizzly Manchild. Yeah. His freaking wildlife photography is unbelievable. That was actually very good. He was so informative, very knowledgeable of everything. I mean, we probably saw 30 moose, tons of elk, tons of bighorn sheep. And a badger. We saw a badger. I've never saw a badger before. That was really cool. Yeah, um, that is a, honestly, really recommend doing that. He kind of feel if you want to just see wildlife if you want to take photos whatever but very good what was your thoughts it was oh, awesome. i loved it. Awesome. It, was good. it was awesome it was great we've seen a lot of good things it today. was above and beyond what i expected and i expected to be good but it was yeah it was good it was real good oh, if you're in jackson absolutely recommend that free little water bottle tons yeah. of snacks actually yesterday's breakfast at persephone we had the same muffins this morning and creekside market he said best grab and go sandwiches and coffee and, and breakfast burritos yeah i got a breakfast burrito this morning it was super good that wraps up that safari that was awesome uh, i don't know what we're gonna do today they're all going to the hill climb but we're gonna drive around and go maybe more into teton national park oh that cabin oh yeah all right we are walking back to the infamous ta molten barn but in the winter time it's closed the road i think it opens may 1st so the shortest access point is on Antelope Flats Road. So we parked, and it's probably, I don't know, maybe half a mile or so. It's like three fourths of a mile. Yeah, our guide this morning that we took on the safari said it's about three fourths of a mile back here. So we're going to walk back there because it's spring ish. The uh, roads. It's a paved road. Yeah, it's paved and it's plowed right now, so it's not too bad. So that's where we're heading right now. Now we're on Mormon Row. Oh, just had to get through a little bit of mud to get there, but hey. Here we are, we're coming up. You can see. All right, we made it to the T.A. Molten Barn, right? Yeah, yeah, we're on Mormon Road right now. So we walked up, it's about, about a, maybe, honestly, a little, maybe a mile and a quarter. Yeah, there's another one right over there. So yeah, the Mormons were sent here from the Salt Lake Valley to expand the uh, Mormon uh, population. Yeah. Um, and yeah, it's all settled in there. So there's just a bunch of old barns and stuff. Um, this is one of the most iconic with the Tetons back here, mm -hmm. but uh, oh, yeah, it's it's amazing. stopped at uh actually we drove through Grand Teton National Park here 
and it's pretty much all closed. You can only drive like 28 miles back, but we're in t-shirts and the snow is piled up, you know, probably four foot high. Yeah. Crazy right here. Last year we were able to, this, this was like all yeah, this plowed. was all plowed last year. We could year. go like literally touch the sign. Yeah, but we're not gonna this time, so we're gonna stand right here and get a pick in the background of it. There's the pick. All right, but yeah, we're gonna just get back in the truck here. Yeah, pretty much, we're we're trying to drive back as far as you can to get to Yellowstone, but um, it's it's you get 28 miles back and it's closed. But we were hoping to, to at least see some wildlife, but we did not see any yet. We, but we saw more than our fair share this morning. So oh, this morning was perfect. Yeah, so that's all that's all good. <laughs> We got Two our huckleberry milkshakes with yes. whipped cream and cherry. Yep, we got it last year and it was incredible. And yeah. we had to get it. We might get it tomorrow too. The um, ice cream. Oh, uh, maybe. I might get another milkshake. Everything you remember? Mm hmm. It's good. Nibbles cherry. All right, we went back to the cabin for a little bit, and we are about to go to Pinky G's, which is what I was thinking of this entire time. It was the best food we had last trip. Greet you with an elk. I wonder if they have the uh, South Park finger bang that they had last. Yep, there it is. Can I get a flying Hawaiian? We have a flying Hawaiian and the fatty. And then the wings. So this is a diner driving to dive's place. It's always gangster. It's when he's involved. Well, that wraps up our day. Uh, the wildlife so far. Really, really long day actually. We got up kind of early. Very long day. Yeah. Woke up at 6:30. Had an awesome wildlife safari. And then we went to the Tetons. Then we went to Mormon Row. Uh, saw the barn. Got some pictures. Came back, hung out. Came back, hung out. Went, went to, to Pinky G's. Yes. Which was very good. And then we dipped out on Million Dollar Cowboy Bar. Yeah. And mom and dad and uh, Andrew and Lexi are in line. And look, I would love to go, but it is... I'm freaking beat. Yeah, I'm just tired. Um, but I'm so glad we went the other night. The place was awesome. It's yeah. definitely the hangout. Yeah. It's definitely the hangout here. I mean, there's the bar, the stools are like horse saddles. Horse, then, horse saddles? Is this where we go right here? Yeah. They had a place like dining to eat. Yep. And then they had another place like bar stools to drink. And then they had a the dance floor. Yeah. There's like a lot of stuff going on. Yeah. No, it's awesome. But we are going snowboarding tomorrow morning. The next morning. Good morning. We are about to load up the truck here and go to Jackson Hole Mountain Resort and go snowboarding today. <sighs> it might be kind of warm today, but hey, that's all part of the experience in the spring here. So we are about to leave right now and go get some coffee. Made it to Jackson Mountain Resort. We are here. You ready? I am. Okay, we're gonna hit the Bridger Run first. Take us up to the top and then just get the shredding. Up here at Bridger, and there were a lot of uh, hair Yeah. So um, it's kind of slushy, but hey, gonna make the best of it today. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. Okay, ready? My vents. Uh, oh like, crap. I opened them and like, oh, knowing me, this is gonna be bad news. Dude, I just pulled it out of my freaking vent. <laughs> just all the way down there. It, it feels like freaking 
Dude, it's it's legit hot here. I wish I had a hoodie. Yeah. It is so hot. All right, we're trying to cut over now to hit the other side of the mountain. We're at Apres, Apres Vals. Apres Vals, I think. I think that's what they call I ever heard that. I know that's right. I Googled it. Pav. We're gonna go eat lunch after this run. We're gonna make our way, make our way down to the base. <sighs> pizza and a beer for seven bucks so it was 14 bucks for both of this no McDonald's yesterday we had McDonald's yesterday. but yeah this uh, family vacation I got it here last time feels like it's tradition you know I got to I love the can and Highwayman is very good. I got that the other this, night. This same brand, but Highwayman is really good. So we ate good. dinner the other night. Roadhouse Brewing. Be about to eat the pizza and then... We finished our pizza and it was super good. Man, that's like that's like a hidden gem. Seriously, uh, South Cable. South Cable. South Cable. Pizza. I'm not kidding. A massive yeah. pizza pizza. And a drink for seven bucks. Yeah. Cannot beat it. Can't beat that at all. We might have time for one more, two more runs. Um, didn't do a whole lot of vlogging today. I was just trying to, just trying to ride and just enjoy it. So, do you ever miss her? Miss who? That is the right answer. Out cold. We're at the top of Hangman's Peak right now. <laughs> one thing Mr. Majors did come through on is building a, building a lift all the way to the top. So, we're here at Hangman's Peak. Just joking. We're at the top of Jackson. It's an out cold joke. It's an out cold joke. Probably only two of you will get it. That's probably me and Abby rewatching it. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're at top of Bridger again. I don't know, maybe one or two runs, but I mean, this view just doesn't get old. All right, let's do this run. Did you miss? Yeah. There. I just saw the most beautiful mountain peaks. They're on there. Right there. <sighs> Too bad. All right, last run. Ready, babe? Yep. Okay, let's go. We're gonna catch Abby. Go fast. We got a picture of her. Looking all cute. The Max Super Review Max Lens. God. Faster. That was 
was the last run. It was that's fun through there actually. It's a little icier than it was this morning, but it was still really fun. You got it, Groovy? Yep, I did. Alright, good. No, I wanted to use that mod mode. Oh yeah. Alright, that was our time here at Jackson Hole. Hey, you know what? Snow condition went the best, but we still had a great time. Milkshake. It tastes just like, um, I don't know, maybe. Well, we had an epic day today Whoa. snowboarding. We ice came cream. back. Abby got the Huckleberry ice cream this time. She said it was really good. I took a bite. It was really good. And then I got the milkshake again. Yeah, you could tell everyone was just like, Drained. yeah, everyone's tired. But um, this is the last night in Jackson. And we are ending it with Big Hole Barbecue. Andrew, it slaps. Okay. See? Sounds you know, good. Nice. You know it's good. It's 52 degrees right now. It's pretty crazy. Whole pork sandwich, baked beans, and mac and cheese. I got a burger, and everyone else got all kinds of barbecue. And Brady didn't get anything. Nothing. Was it good? Yes, it was good. The big hole was bussin'. That was super, super good. And we're heading back, going to bed. Everyone's leaving tomorrow, including us, but we don't leave till... Later. Yeah, later, so... We might get breakfast burrito in the morning because everyone else says they're so good. Yeah, we'll, we'll tell you goodbye tomorrow in the vlog. But for now, we'll tell you goodnight. Goodnight. Have sweet dreams. Oh, sweet dreams. The next morning. Good morning. It is our last morning in Jackson, and everybody it's a, left. Everybody left. Um, it's a very crisp morning, but so peaceful just hearing the birds, and there is a cool, crisp mountain air, but it still feels really good. It's like 32 degrees right now, but um, yeah, we we're we don't have to leave for a couple hours. Yeah. Yep. No. So. But we're gonna go to get um, the, some ice. Well, ice coffee for me. And, Hot coffee for me. Yeah, um, we're gonna go to this place called Cowboy Coffee. It's the number one coffee place on Yelp. And then we're gonna go get burritos at DOG. <laughs> Everyone's yeah. already had on this trip except us, so they've said they're so good, so I cannot wait to try it. I love breakfast burritos. So that's where we're heading right now. Spicy meat, um, and Abby got the mild meat burrito, but this thing is so good. Nice sauce to dip in. Don't want to dip too aggressively though, because all my toppings will follow. But no, this place is great. Great music too. So far, for Vampire Weekend, and then we heard Postal Service is playing now. Man, burritos, good music. Is there anything better? It's true, there's not. Maybe a little huckleberry scent right in here. We just finished our burritos. Mm. That was freaking amazing. Oh my gosh. It so had good. like hash browns, eggs, uh, sauteed onions. There's bacon, like meat in it. Eggs, yeah. Bacon, eggs, ham, I think. Maybe it was ham. Yeah, I think it was ham. Oh my gosh. Highly, highly, highly recommend it. It was very good. And it's called DOG. Don't call it dog. No, it stands for Down on Glen because yeah, they're on Glen Street. Yep. Highly recommend that. We're heading back to pack up our room right now and then get out of Dodge. All right. Well, that wraps up. Our trip. Yeah, I walked out of the door. Everything's packed up, and I got really sad. It was a good 
trip. It was very good. I know it sounds goofy, but just like, just being here in general, just like. Yeah. Anytime we're like in the mountains or like near the mountains, it's always such a peaceful feeling. Especially when you could smell like the pine, and just such a nice feeling. I guess. Makes me feel alive. Recharged. No. Yeah, it Recharged actually. Recharged on life. At peace, actually. So. Oh, I think our taxi's here. It is time for us to go. All right. Thanks see ya. for watching. And be sure to hit that like and hit that subscribe if you haven't already. Bye! Bye. That way in case you have multiple situations. <laughs> Alright, so it is technically the next day. Oh, yeah, we got home after, what, 2 o'clock a.m.? Yeah, it was like 12.45, I think. Um, but we, so we went to work and now we're picking up Puckleberry because since it was so late we weren't able to pick him up the same day. Um, so we're gonna pick him up. I'm sure he's gonna be super excited to come home. So, yeah, we're the, almost. Yeah, this place we're getting him. He stayed at the Diamond Kennels. And let me tell you. This place is nice. And it's really, it's really pretty, I mean, affordable compared to like what other kennel places are, so. Yeah, he's out here living though. He is out here living though. <laughs> Resort for pets. Huckleberry, can you see your mom and dad? Hey, hey. 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 How are you, buddy? So, I don't know how to do that. Okay. Alright, let's go bye-bye. You ready? Skrrr! Come on, buddy. <laughs> Ooh, look at Good that! Boy. Good boy! You ready to go home, buddy? Good boy! We got your report card, so we're gonna have to read it. Mwah. Well, somebody's happy to see us. Oh my gosh, okay. Let's see. We here. got his report card here. Be my behavior. I was happy and comfy. I always <laughs> emptied my bowl. No surprise. He had uh, playtime, cuddle time, snack time. Everything was regular for his potty breaks. Huckleberry was such a good boy. During his stay. Oh, during his stay. He got a absolutely perfect. Aww. Aww. You got an A plus you on, passed, your court, buddy. on your report you passed. card. You passed. You technically failed your last night of obedience school, <laughs> but you, at least you passed on your stay. Aww. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna go home and get La Fiesta Express now. Yes, and have a family night at home. Yep.